Let us see our first interesting example. We have to find the correct expression of 6.46 in fractional form. Our options are given over here. Where if you see your 4 6 in the question is reoccurring. So how to solve this? Let us see. Since 6.46 bar is in pure reoccurring form, we have to convert it into vulgar fraction. That is, they have two digits after the point. So, we are going to separate 6.46 into 6 plus 0 0.46 bar. Since your 46 is the reoccurring part, we have to convert it into vulgar fraction that is the number itself in the numerator by the denominator as the number of 9s is the reoccurring part. So here we have 2 reoccurring part hence 2 9. Solving this, we get 640 by 99 that is option D. Hence, option D will be your answer. These pattern of questions appear in government, bank, TCS and Wipro exams. Let us move on to our next interesting question. We have to find the difference between 3.87 and 2.59. Our options are given over here as 1.20 1.2 bar, 1.27 bar and 1.28 bar. Let us see how to solve this. So here if you see 87 is the reoccurring part and 59 is the reoccurring part. So, 3.87 can be written as 3 plus 0 0.87 minus 2 plus 0 0.59. 87 is written as 87, that is the numerator, the number itself, by the number of reoccurring part, that is 2, hence 2, 9. Here you have 59 by 2, 9. which is equal to 1 plus 87 by 99 plus 59 by 99. That is equal to 1 plus 28 by 99. Our final answer is 1.28 bar since 28 is by 99 hence 2 reoccurring part hence 2 8 bar that is option D will be your answer. Let us see our next interesting question. We have 0 0.04 multiplied by 0 0.0162. What will be the equal to? Our options are as follows. Let us see how to solve this. We are multiplying the numbers using normal numbers without decimal points. So 4 into 162 is equal to 648. And now we have to find out the decimal places after the decimal point. Here you have two decimal places and here you have four decimal places. So totally you have six decimal places. Hence our final answer is located after 6 decimal places after the decimal point. So, 648 is your final answer. It will be after 6 decimal places after your decimal point. That is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Hence, 6 places after the decimal point 
will be your answer which is equal to 6.48 multiplied by 10 power minus 4 so our answer is option B these pattern of questions appear in government, bank, CTS and HCL exams. Thank you so much for joining GTEC on Decimal Fractions.